And the saying goes, necessity is the mother of all invention. And there's been no greater necessity or need in recent memory than what we've experienced during the COVID-19 pandemic. That is true. It's changed almost every way of life. Now student entrepreneurs are putting their minds together to figure out new business ventures to solve some of the pandemic's problems. KXN's Nabil Ramadna takes us inside UT's Impact Factory. The Impact Factory at UT Austin looks for ways to use business skills to help the most vulnerable populations. We're in the business of innovation and entrepreneurship for good. Dr. Michael Hull is a mentor and advisor to the students in the program. He says his students find a problem and go to work trying to fix it. And during the pandemic, he's seen them do just that. So these are remarkable student entrepreneurs who are out there learning good things while they're doing good things. We're an Austin-based produce delivery service fighting food insecurity. Zach Timmons took a problem and created Good Apple, a grocery delivery service looking to stomp out food insecurity. When the pandemic hit, he did even more. We kind of switched some of our impact efforts from focusing mainly on children to serving people who are elderly and immunocompromised. And so that's really where our stay home, stay healthy program started. Since starting the business, Good Apple has served more than 800,000 pounds of food. And, you know, we've been so thankful to have been able to serve over 26,000 people since we launched the company. We really wanted to focus on how do we get food kind of directly to people's doors or to places that they trust. Good Apple, just one of the many programs Hull has helped students launch, making a difference now and in the future. Some students will want to take the venture beyond their graduation and continue it for years. And to learn even more about the Impact Factory and the programs that are helping out in our communities, just go to our website, kxan.com, and click on this story. Back to you. Thank you, Nabil. The Impact Factory has played a big part in helping big and many get started. The video conferencing platform and smartphone app matches seniors and teens to bridge generations and combat loneliness. And since they launched in April of 2020, they have grown to 2,500 users. I really didn't think I fit the demographic of being a lonely elder, but I think I was lonelier than I gave myself, than I was willing to acknowledge. We really see this as kind of something that will hopefully become a long-term long -term resource for older adults, um, as well as the college-age students as well, because, I mean, personally, myself and so many people I know are kind of going through something similar with isolation. Yeah, Big and Many has expanded to all 50 states and is now worldwide.